Hi YouTube, this is Jake Chasen here, and today we'll be demonstrating how the Mac can receive and interact with these new emotional messages that Apple introduced as part of iOS 10 at WWDC. So let's get started. So first of all, we're going to verify we're running Mac OS Sierra on this machine. So I opened up about this Mac, and we can see that this is definitely Mac OS Sierra. On the iPhone, someone will need iOS 10. If we go to the settings app, general, about, we can see that it is running version 10.0. So now let's open up messages on the Mac. And let's open up messages on the iPhone. So the Mac is unable in Mac OS Sierra to send these messages to the iPhone, but that doesn't mean that it can't receive them. And it can still reply with the emojis. So I'm going to send a message to myself. And we'll click the up arrow, and let's say, we'll start with a slam, send. So as you can see right there, it didn't actually show the effect. Let's try another one. Loud. It didn't show that effect either. Let's try gentle. Didn't show gentle. Let's try invisible. It was able to show the invisible, however, it seems as though it's very buggy because it's not moving around like it is on the iOS. As you can see, the invisible ink is kind of looking like dust. Uh, on the iPhone, on the Mac, it really doesn't look like that. It kind of just look like pixels that are blinking. And on the iPhone, when we go like this and we tap it, you can see it automatically kind of goes out like that. On the Mac, when we hover over it, the physics are pretty good and it does let you push the things away. And there it goes. However, if you notice, it's a little bit more blurry. It doesn't seem like the text is of the same sharpness as the other messages. But it does come back to the original invisible ink like its iPhone counterpart does. So now you can acknowledge a message by right-clicking on it, clicking Acknowledge, and then choosing something. So right now, let's go with Thumbs Up. Click Thumbs Up. Nothing appeared in the iPhone. Now let's write back. Hello from Mac. Let's acknowledge on the iPhone that we like that. And we can see that it was acknowledged on the Mac. So it seems like some things are syncing and other things are not syncing. Let's try some of these new app extension based things. Let's send a cursor from the iPhone to the Mac. Click cursor, tell it to send, and as you can see, it did send the cursor. However, two cursors appeared. One appeared below the delivered and one appeared above the delivered. When I tried to further interact with it and I click on the pointer, you can see that I'm clicking on the bottom one and the top one's appearing, which leads me to believe this is more of a bug. Oh, and it appears as though the bottom one just went away by itself. All right, YouTube, thank you for watching this video about how Messages for Mac works and how it kind of works with its iOS 10 counterpart. This is Jake Chasen, and I'm signing off.